Hello, and welcome to another Ponage tutorial. In this tutorial, uh, from Popular Request. Sorry about that terrible English there, but Popular Request. I have made a tutorial about uh, the easiest way of changing the icons on your desktop. Okay, it's really simple. First off, download this. Uh, it's 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 basically freeware. It's called Pixadex. I'll have a link to it. Um to your right hand side if you know what I mean in my in my comments whatever so download that and then once you've downloaded that open it up and get yourself some icons um, I'm just gonna download some icons from interfacelift.com uh, while I'm downloading this may I add the two best sites for icons for the Mac is interfacelift.com and uh, what's it called iconfactory.com so uh, download that and then you can just take all these icons and drag them onto your Pixadex thing and now they've all loaded so now it's as easy as this to change someone's icon you do window show uh, quick drop choose the icon you want to change a folder too. I'll just use this one. Now drag the folder onto that quick drop. Click. Wait, here. I'll, I'll use another folder because I already did that one. Okay. New folder. So I can just take that folder, drag it onto there, drop, and there we go. Changed to some nice, wonderful boxes. Anyway, uh, so that's that's one way of changing icons. But say that you wanted one second. Uh, hold up. Okay. That's what I want, right? Say you wanted to change the icon of your hard drive, like I've done to mine, so it looks like a pretty MacBook. Um, what you do is you download a program called Live Icon, and just wait for that to load up. And using Live Icon, come on you can change the uh, appearance of things on your dock that's how I changed my finder icon you can change the appearance of my external hard drives internal hard drives CD-ROMs stuff like that damn even even floppy disks that's that's crazy anyway it's it's really cool so live icon and Pixadex are really good things to use I guess anyway I'll have links to them to your right, and please, please, please check out my blog. I made a blog. That's right. I'm blogging. And on my blog, it's it's going to be the same as my videos, except minus the videos and plus a lot more uh, turnover rate, I guess you say. Meaning I'm going to have at least one blog post a day about something really cool that you can do with your Mac, or just something really cool in general like how to slice bread. Anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, keep, keep your windows clean.